And this animal, this happened to shoot halfway out of here. That's what I'm talking about when you got to be really careful with these guys. <laughs> Look at this snake. There's two foot of her hanging out of this cage. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. We have got some good Venom Cam action coming at you this time. Subscribe now. Fangs in your face. How you guys doing? Hey, before we get rolling, I gotta thank my big supporters. I wanna thank all my supporters, but Sean Black, thank you, brother. Len Brewer. Len, how the hell are you, brother? We haven't heard from you in a little while. We're getting a little concerned. <laughs> Dina said she heard from you, you're doing good, but keep us in the loop, buddy. <laughs> we think about you all the time, Len. Uh, hey, Paul Breslin. Thank you so much, Paul. Jerome Kelly, um, Peter Carmichi. Thank you, Peter. Uh, Paul Behan and I'm gonna tell you um, Wally Tucker thank you so much and thanks to all the Venom Squad for all the backup you guys give us here at Venom Central hey guys before we get started um, this sad news you know one of our Venom Squad if you guys remember we did the hashtag share the pain you know Phil's dad well, Phil's dad passed away just recently um, he lost his battle with cancer, and uh, and I'm gonna tell you, uh, it's it, it it it's it's a sad thing losing a parent, <laughs> and and I just lost both my parents, and just in the past year. And Phil, we're with you, brother, and and we do share your pain. I know that pain all too well, trust me. But uh, Phil, keep your head up, brother. Um, this episode is dedicated to Phil's dad. You know, Phil and his dad, his last couple of months of his life did. They enjoyed each other's company watching YouTube videos and stuff, and that's how they found me. And and it it, it kind of touched our hearts here, you know. And uh, and, and it, it it does. It makes us very sad. But Phil, we're with you, brother. Hey, we love you. Uh, stay strong, bro. Keep your head up. Big Daddy's got a top row seat watching you now, you know. And uh, this episode's dedicated to Phil's dad. Everybody, let's show him some love. Hashtag Phil's dad. Hey guys, so this video today, it, it, this could just be another fun one, okay? Um, we were gonna do a longer educational video and I've got a couple of really good ones planned. I know you guys wanna learn more about the, the Rhino Vipers and, and the Thai Pans and we're gonna do all that, but I wanted this to be a just a fun one that, that Phil can enjoy. And so that's why we're dedicating this to Phil's dad. So it's a bunch, I mean, it's there are some crazy fangs in your face coming. You got to stay to the end. The best ones are at the end. The Bushmasters are in rare form. There's some really good ones. But pay attention to the very first one where we're feeding the, the adult Mugenai. That male, his strike is so fast, it's just like pop, right? But when we slow it down, you're going to realize he fangs this thing four times. I mean, uh, 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 uh. and they do all that so fast, it's just unbelievable. But we, we've learned so much with this setup I, I built to film these slow-mo shots face on that I've learned so much about behavior and so much about the way they deliver a strike that it's, it's just incredible. I mean, I'm writing an article on it. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's really tremendous what we're learning about this, but it just blows my mind. I mean, four times, I mean, not just chewing, he brings the fang out and sticks it back in on each side four times crazy but guys go ahead watch it enjoy it it's fun get it <laughs> all right male bothros mugenai see if he bites and releases or if he bites and hangs on oh yeah, good hit buddy
did the strike and release technique. Now let's move over and see what the female does. And he's been doing this. He bites and releases. When the female's more apt to hang on. Back it up, Bubba. We're going to set that right there for you. All right. Let's see what old Big Mama with Jenna is going to do here. Let's see if she hangs on. Oh, that a girl. Good bite. I notice that behavior. She bites and she hangs on. She does a total different technique from the male. And I am finding this out that females are more apt to do this. Males will bite and release. Females will hang on. Pretty interesting. Bothross Mugenai. The Brazilian lance head. Alright guys. This is one of our Rutus. Bothrops Alternatus. Oh! Good boy! Spook you. Alright, it's another Arutu. Bothrops Alternatives. You can see she's a little overzealous there. <laughs> There's the hot rat girl. Light it up. There you go. Good girl. Get up there, Mama. Set that right there for you. Man, I can't wait to reproduce this snake next year. <laughs> next season, boys. We'll show you this one having babies. This one's going to pop out some screamers. Alright, guys. I'm up here on a damn ladder feeding this big Mama Arutu. We got her in a cage. is up pretty high. <laughs> But, let's see how she does today. See if we can get this nice head-on strike. Give her a little bit of tap. Oh! That snake is a fast son of a bitch. All right, big girl. There you go. We'll lay it right there for you. <laughs> Look at her. She's like, I ain't moving. Very nice. Bothrops Alternatus. They root to. Okay, we got a snake up in the box here. <laughs> we did have a snake up in the box. <laughs> another little Zobcon. We'll see how that strike came out. Let's leave that right there for him. Alright, look at this little guy. He's peeking out. As soon as he picks up this heat signature, he's going to come blazing. Let's see if we can get this. Well, maybe the light might be spooking him. <laughs> hey, buddy. 
There you go. Oh, yeah. Very nice. He's gonna hang on to, huh? That a boy. It's another Yucatan rattlesnake. All right, Bubba, come on, come get some. <laughs> oh, that a boy. Look at him. Look how far he's hanging out of there. Now I gotta lift him up and put him back. <laughs> All right, Bubba, you got it. Big old beast. Oh, he gonna pull back up in there on his own. That a boy. That's one of our big adult male Zobcons. The Crowless Zobcon. That's the Yucatan rattlesnake. He's a beauty. You gotta be a big old boy. Another Zobcon. Oh yeah, he's on it now. See if we can lure him out here a little bit. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Hit. There you go. Nice hit. Alright guys, we got a, a Bushmaster coming in hot. Look at that. Look at that thermal bobbin. Oh, that's cool! Oh, <laughs> that a girl. That a girl. It's one of my little girls I'm raising up. Oh, that's cool. She is a live wire boy. That's a good girl. And that's just a baby. That's just a little one. <laughs> that's the Latisa Stenophrys. What a cool animal. And this animal this happened to shoot halfway out of here. This is what I'm talking about when you got to be really careful with these guys. <laughs> Look at this snake. There's two foot of her hanging out of this cage. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. They are definitely aggressive. Let me tell you something. See this here? I just cracked the corner of this cage and she shot out of there like a missile. I had to back way up and reposition everything so I can do this safely. <laughs> That's why the, the Bushmasters are nothing to play with, boy. They mean business. Okay, guys, we're going to try to lure this this young male, Lachesis Tenafries, we're gonna try to lure him all the way out here. Let him pick up that. Oh! <laughs> Tried to put
pull it away from him, but he was a little too fast. I wanted to see if I can lure him out to the middle of the room. Usually they'll chase you. They'll come out after that food and they'll follow it wherever it goes, but he's a little bit on his game tonight. <laughs> it's nighttime and these guys are all fired up. They're all in hunt mode. All right, buddy, he get in there. <laughs> I go to show you, you ain't faster than a damn snake. You ain't never gonna be faster than a Bushmaster. That was cool. All right, let's feed a couple of these little youngsters. Let's try to reel him. Oh, 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 oh boy! Man, he come out here like a scud missile. At a boy. They are definitely an apex predator. This is just a youngster too. He's already about three and a half foot, maybe four foot. Just now two years old. Look at that animal. What an impressive creature. Jesus Tanafris. All right, guys, this this little young Bushmaster's up in his box. Let's see if we can lure him out here. Oh! <laughs> goodness he was in a hurry wasn't he <laughs> ain't no luring him nowhere he come blazing out of there what a hit man they're just freaking ferocious it's nighttime they're all in hunt mode all right let's see if we can bring this little gal up here Alright. Yep, she's picked up a heat signature. And she's getting ready to explode. There it comes. Here comes the tongue. Let's see if we can lure her up here. She's being cautious. That's a girl. Come on, baby. That a girl. Nice hit. Pure accuracy. Accurate as some bitch. There you go, baby. I hope you guys enjoyed this one today. Phil, keep your head up, brother. Hey guys, if you're new to the channel, hit that V logo, subscribe now. Don't waste no time. Just get it done. Hey, come on back and check us out at Venom Central. This is Willie. We're checking out. Later.